Bionic King here. Some of you may know that um, I was looking around at game makers a lot. Um, one thing that I found really useful was RPG Maker XV. Um, well, useful depending on how much you know about how to use it. So I decided to make a tutorial on it. Um, I'm just gonna open that up. Um, it automatically opens to the last thing you were doing, or if you weren't doing anything yet, it just automatically opens up to a blank screen. Um, right now I'm on the trial, but... Okay, new. It'll ask you what folder to put it in, and what to name it. I'll name it. Oh, and the game title is automatically set to the folder name. If you change the folder name, that is, you can change the game name and it still works. So, this is the folder it's saved in. Um, you can change that here. Okay. And, oh, here we go. So, you start out with map 001. This here is water. Very boring. Um, this is just the first one, so I'm just going to show you how to use everything and all, and how to get used to it. Um, this is your tiles area. A is terrains. B is outdoor objects. C is indoor objects. D is miscellaneous. And E is things you've imported. I don't have anything imported for this game yet, because I just created it. These are all your various maps. You may have many maps. Um, this is the map editor where you put the tr where you combine these two. Most important, new game or project. Well, oh, making a new game. So, open project, save project, cut, copy, paste, delete, undo, passage settings tell you about that in another one. Map. This means like I click and drag things on there like this. What event does is it lets you make e make things happen really. Tell you about that later. Um these are all your tools, tell you about them later. Your zoom. You almost never need to go show one A database this is where you can keep track of all your stuff it's all on preset right now but resource manager um this is what you have like what do you have to use <coughs> sorry i am got a little bit of a throat thing i don't know why script editor this it's actual script um not sure what the script is called or what that all is. Um, some of you might want to use that if you're used to that kind of stuff. Sound test. This is where you just listen to sounds. They anytime you're going to use sounds, this pops up anyway, so doesn't really matter. And play test. Oh, it always asks you to save. And yes, that was an annoying sound. I know. Save changes. Yes. This is the default for. Um, I'm turn the volume down. This is the default for when the game starts. The background. These three are always there. I don't think you can change them, but if you're really good, you might be able to. I'm not sure. And I got this guy on an island. He can do absolutely nothing. You use the arrow keys to move, and then the enter button as action. I think there's a way to change the controls. Well, that's all for now. Bionic King, out.